My name is Lorianne Benner. I'm a reliability engineer for PIMI. I work up and down the country and we also have projects across the world. I'm a mechanical engineer but I also work in condition-based monitoring. So that can be thermal imaging, oil analysis and vibration. So we're working in preventative maintenance to reduce breakdowns and downtime. We're a contractor company and we work in blue chip factories across the country, including well-known sugar manufacturer, pet foods. So it's all um, processing factories that we work in. My father works for Prince's and he's worked there 23 years. So he got me interested in the process inside. And my husband is a plant mechanic. So he got me interested in the engineering side. And my granddad always told me you need to have a trade. <laughs> I applied to College of West Anglia. They had an advertisement in the local newspaper for apprenticeships in engineering. And through the College of West Anglia, PME contacted me. And from there, I went through an interview stage and I got the placement within PME. When I was at school, to be honest, I didn't know what I wanted to do. Through my GCSEs, I didn't have a clear career pathway that I wanted to go down. And I went through A-levels and I still was unsure. I attended a few career open days in Norwich to try and get some ideas and talk into my father, my grandfather and my husband. Um, I became interested in what my husband was doing in engineering as he was going through his apprenticeship at the time. At my school, if you didn't get all A stars, you weren't good enough. So, and I wasn't an A star student. And I was basically told that my only option was forces. <laughs> I've done an interview with my school magazine, which is going out this year. Um, saying the opportunities that are, there are within apprenticeships and how I've done with my career. I don't think many people thought that I was able or able to go into this sort of career and especially not as, do as well as I could. So, <laughs> I did a short term week at university as a taster and it wasn't the right atmosphere, it wasn't the best way for me to learn. I'm very hands-on and I wanted to get the practical experience in the job and also wanted the chance to earn the money while I'm learning. I myself am 21, my husband's 23 and at a very young age we were able to afford things that most people wouldn't at our age. There's a wide range in the engineering sector that I could have gone into. Um, but my main focus was processing. Um, the processing industry is fantastic and what they can do and the new technology that's coming out. PME have set out a career pathway for me and there are a large number of opportunities and with the sites we have, we have opportunity, opportunities across the world. For me, there aren't any ordinary days. I, one day I could be doing mechanical maintenance the next day I could be doing a thermal imaging survey of electrical panels and then the day after that I could be setting up a computerised uh, SAP or Shire system. So the first year at college was full time, second year was part time at college and then the third year was full time on site. University is for some people but the opportunities you have in an apprenticeship, you're able to earn the money while you're learning, you're able to have your qualifications as you're working, and you've got the experience that you're building with your on-site mentors who have been in this job for more years than you've probably been alive. So you're getting the experience from them, which is really important. I'm glad I took this path. It's a fantastic career and I, I love what I do.